Hello friends, welcome to Error Code. I am Tanay. Today we are making hand tracker and finger counter using Python. So let's start. There are too many ways to do this, but I am using my own package CVLearn. To install it, open CMD and type pip install CVLearn and press enter. CVLearn is installed now. We are using PyCharm IDE. First, let's import OpenCV module. For that, we have to type import CV2. To take internal webcam input, we have to type cap equals to CV2 dot video capture 0. If we want to take external webcam input instead of internal, uh, then we have to change this 0 to 1. Now let's create a loop. For that we have to type while true let comma frame equals to cap dot read. This will read every frame of the video capture. To show this frame, we have to type cv2 dot im show result which is a string and frame. Now we have to type cv2 dot wait key 1. If we do 0 instead of 1 here, this code will not work because this wait key function checks for our input after a delay. Here this 0 is delay. This means it will infinitely check if any key is pressed and forget to run our code. So we have to do one here. This is my external webcam input. To find hands in this input, we have to import hand tracking module from CVLearn. For that, we have to type import CVLearn dot hand tracking module as htm. Now let's make a detector. For that, we have to type detector equals to htm dot hand detector. In our loop, we have to type detector dot find hands frame. Now this code is detecting the hand and tracking it. To add finger counter to it, we have to import finger counter from CVLearn. For that, we have to type import cvlearn.fingercounter as counter. Now let's make a variable finger counter. Finger counter equals to counter dot finger counter. In our loop, we have to find hands position and the bounding box. For that, we have to type landmark list, lm list, and d box equals to detector dot find position frame. Now we have to check if lm list is empty or not. If it is not, then we have to count the fingers. For that, we have to type if lm list is not equal to 0, then finger counter dot draw counted fingers frame lm list and d box.
Now it's counting the fingers. That's it for today's video. Hope you liked it. So please like, share and subscribe. See you in the next video. Till then. Bye bye.